Convert between deanery and binary then. So let's just cover the basics. Deanery is the number system that you know and love and use probably every single day, whereas binary is the number system that computers are stuck using, which can only have the numbers ones and zeros in it because they use switches, they're stuck on switches computers. Um, and then when you're in primary school, you will probably say, had to talk something like this. If you had to represent 13 sweeties in a jar, um, then we've got no hundreds, we've got 110, and we've got three units, okay? So that idea, 110, hundreds, that's how that works. Um, the key to understanding binary is it's the same trick. It's exactly the same trick. So we have units, we get the idea of one still, except instead of going up in tens and hundreds, we go we double each time. So we got one, two, four, eight, okay? And then if I had 13 sweeties in a jar to represent that, then I can do that making up these numbers using each one just once if need be. So one eight and one four, and then one one is 13. Eight plus four plus one is 13. So that is how I represent 13 in binary, okay? And all you need to, to do really is just keep doubling the number at the top and you can make any single number that you want. So let's just uh, let's just do a quick conversion. Let's say I've got this binary number here and it's got eight numbers in it. Um, yeah, let's say uh, one, two, five, six, seven, eight. Then all I need to do if I get this binary number is start with one on the right hand side, keep doubling, keep doubling all the way. So we've got eight, 16, 32, 64, and 128, you won't be asked to add um, to figure out any number above eight bits, as it's called, because it's eight binary digits. Um, so you only need to go to 128. And then I add up all the numbers that have a one underneath them. So that is 128 um, plus 32 plus 16 um, plus eight plus two. And if I add all these together, then that gives me my answer. That shows me how much this is in deanery. So let's do this quickly. Got 10, 10, 6, so you got 26, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and there's 186 then is what uh, what that what that is. And all I've done is just add up all the numbers that have a one underneath them using your, your sort of basic maths, okay? So that's how you convert from um, binary to deanery, but you also need to go the other way around. You might need to convert that into, into deanery. So um, let's have another number then. Let's go for 100 and, 194, okay, let's hope that's not too hard a number. Um, I start off just doing exactly the same thing. So I start off with one, two, four, eight, and I keep doubling, keep doubling, all the way up to 128. Now, if you've got a small number that you need to worry about, that you need to convert, then this gets quite easy. So if I've got, so let's say I've got nine, I need to convert the number nine, I can probably figure out in my head, okay, I need an eight and I need a one, and then I'm, I'm sorted for nine. I can put zeros under everything else. But if you've got a larger number like 194, then you usually need a bit of a method to figure out how to do it. And the method is this. Um, I ask myself, okay, is 128 greater than or equal to 194? I ask myself this, is 194 greater than or equal to 128? If it is, I put a one underneath it and I subtract that number from my total. So right now I've got 194 to start with. I'm going to subtract 128 from it, and that means I'm going to end up with 66. And then I ask myself, okay, is 66 greater than or equal to 64? Yes, it is. So I'm going to put a 1 underneath that, and now I'm going to subtract 64 from my total, and then I'm going to end up with 2. Um, and then I ask myself, okay, is 2 greater than 32? No, so put a 0 underneath it. Is 2 greater than, uh, greater than or equal to 16? No. Greater than or equal to 8? No. Greater than or equal to 4? No. Greater than or equal to 2? Yes. So I'm going to put a 1 underneath, and now I'm going to end up with uh, with 0, aren't I? I'm going to end up with 0, so I can end up with 0 in that out. And there I've converted from uh, my deanery number 194 to binary now, so that is 11000010. And that's your method. If you found that video useful, please hit the like button and hit subscribe to the channel. Keep learning and revising more computer science by clicking on the videos linked here.